I mean, I saw King Richard, the Will Smith movie um, with uh, oh. that, that plays Serena and Venus uh, Williams' yes. father. Right, that's like a semi-bio-ish kind of situation, biography-ish. Yeah, deal. it is. It's 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 uh it's definitely worth a watch for sure. Um, it's gonna be Oscar buzz. I think Will's probably gonna win his first Oscar. I think it's gonna happen. It's finally uh, gonna happen. I think it's gonna happen. I think it's his time. He's getting older. Um, there's not too much competition this year for best actor. Mm. Um, he does a phenomenal job. Um, you How know, close to Will in Pursuit of Happiness is this role for him? It's very this this movie is very Pursuit of Happiness. Yeah. It's, it's that, almost, that was the feel I got from the yeah, trailer, right? It, it's 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 almost like it's the same sort of vibe. There's a little bit more comedy in this. Mm. It's not a comedy film, but there's definitely more. Uh, it's more lighthearted than uh, than Pursuit of Happiness, which was very like gloom and you know. You got your feelings kicked in that movie pretty much the entire time. Yeah, like <laughs> you get your feelings kicked a couple times in this movie for yeah. sure. Um, especially if you're a parent. Like, uh, hmm. you know, that's one thing that's like, ever since I became a dad, like movies have changed man, now. Movies, movies are dead. They definitely <laughs> hit different, man. Like different specific topics and different things. Like it of just course. hits different. So like, uh, you know, as a dad, it, it, and he plays a father and he, and he's the star, like it, hmm. the movie's about him. Right. Uh, you know, uh, but, and then after I was done watching the movie, like the last couple of days I've been, uh, watching more venus and serena uh stuff like just i'm more interested in their life i never oh, they, followed they had a them. crazy life bro yeah they're, that's and a i mean they're still ride. doing their thing so you know it's a it's a good it's a good movie um it's not something you should rush out to the theater and watch but um if you can watch it on digital uh which it is released on digital as well so uh you should definitely watch it nice. i i recommend everybody to watch it kayla watched it as well she liked it it's a little long it's like two hours and 20 minutes or so and you can kind of feel the length um it definitely could have been cut like another 10 15 minutes but there wasn't any part where i was like this didn't need to be in the movie it just it started to feel lengthy but i was enjoying it as well like i almost didn't want it to end um i wanted to see more uh but it's it's a it's a it's a it's a it's a coming of age story. It's a it's about a father who uh knew exactly what he wanted for his girls. They wanted it as well. They idolized him. They looked up to him. He had their best interest at heart. He's also a flawed individual. So like he had his own demons and he's doing dealing with his own things. Um but overall, um it's it's just a great sports movie that has a lot of the same tropes as a lot of the other sports movies you've seen in the past with a little bit of a twist. And, uh, you know, I just, I just really, really enjoyed it. Uh, it's not a movie I'll watch again, but it's a movie that uh, deserves a, a watch and deserves praise. And, uh, you know, I, I like... I, I, I can't wait to see a movie if somebody ever does a movie about Tiger Woods, you know, like... Um, oh, that's bound to happen eventually. You know, because they're the Tiger Woods of... Tennis. Tennis, yeah. You know, there's a lot of, like, racial-related things in this film as well. You know, two black sisters coming from Compton to, you know, coming into a world that is literally white. Um, you know, very few It do doesn't get much more players. white than tennis and, no. and golf. It's white, white, right? <laughs> like And, like, rich white. And it's like, still not even, white, white. Yeah, yeah, like, it's not, you know, it's, it's like golf. Like, and I yeah. would even argue that tennis is, might even be even richer than, than golf um, on, very on that scale, right? Because yeah. like in golf, you know, really anybody can pick it up. Same with tennis, but to really get the training that you need and to be in the, you need to join very specific elite clubs that cost a lot of money. And it's a lot of rich families that like, you know, groom their children into becoming these tennis players. And we had, you know, two kids from the ghetto uh, making it and being being dominant and and becoming the the goddesses of their sport and and are the goats of their sport and have been just kind of like Tiger Woods, um, except Tiger Woods' story is a little bit different, but it's sort of very similar. Tracks, parallels. tracks, yeah, tracks similar. Yeah, tracks similar so sure. you know, uh, it hit it from it hit it on all cylinders for me, and you know, I'm black as well, so you know, it kind of it speaks to me as well, and there's a lot of different things in there. 
that I can relate to. And uh, it was just a solid movie. Uh, yeah, might, I, might be one of the better films I've seen this year. I enjoyed I it. I enjoyed it just as much as I did uh, Shang Chi in June. Uh, in June in Dune. Uh, and it's in its own right. They're two, three different, you, totally obviously, different movies. Yeah, but I enjoyed them all. Uh, and you know, I put that up there. He's getting Will Smith. Mark my words. He's winning an Oscar this year for or I guess it would be early next year for uh, for this movie. Wonderful. Well, he, he got the nod for Pursuit, I think. Uh, so maybe this is his second time to bat in that similar vein. So this is, is this his moment? 